me double check? Wait, let me... Yeah, yeah. No, not yet. Yep, 169, 400. It is 169, 400? Mm -hmm. Great, thank you. Okay. I don't want to do that. Sorry. Let's start with the sonic boom. And then the countdown. Nine minutes uh, to touchdown for Discovery now at uh, Edwards Air Force Base. Discovery speed, uh, Mach 5.2, 5.2 times the speed of sound, or about 3,500 miles per hour. Altitude 120,000 feet, or about 22 miles. Range to touchdown, 161 miles. Discovery is approaching the coast of California. Its course will take it almost directly above central Los Angeles. As it uh, goes subsonic and approaches the coast, the uh, sonic boom should be uh, clearly audible in the Los Angeles area. Yep. Discovery now uh, performing a fourth bank as it approaches the California coast to uh, dissipate speed, uh, banking now back to the right with wings angled about to 40 degrees from horizontal. It's a close-up view now of Discovery's uh, final approach toward Edwards. As it approaches Edwards, it'll perform a right overhead 204 degree turn to align with runway 22. That around an imaginary cylinder called the heading alignment cylinder that's created by a microwave landing system for the shuttle installed at uh, Edwards Air Force Base. Discovery Houston, take air data. Take air data. That uh, call to the crew that they can use uh, information supplied by air data probes that are deployed from the nose of the spacecraft for use in navigation. They supply uh, supplemental information on airspeed and altitude using barometric pressure and wind speed. Discovery speed now 2,000 miles per hour, or about three times the speed of sound. Altitude 89,000 feet. 78 miles to Edwards Air Force Base. Six and a half minutes to touchdown. Have a live television view of Discovery now in the uh, center of this view. Discovery uh, Mach 2.5, two and a half times the speed of sound. 69 miles to touchdown at Edwards Air Force Base. Speed 1,470 miles per hour. Discovery's uh, wings leveling now as it approaches the heading alignment cylinder. Discovery Houston, on energy approaching the hack, no change to winds or weather. You're going for nominal shoot deploy. Okay, Dom, uh, copy on and nominal shoot deploy. That call that Discovery's right on target as it, as it approaches uh, the heading alignment cylinder. Again, that cylinder it will perform a right overhead 204 degree turn around to align with runway 22. Discovery's altitude 65,000 feet, speed 860 miles per hour, Discovery about to go subsonic and range to touchdown about to 38 miles.
speed uh, Mach 1, one times the speed of sound now. Altitude 50,000 feet. Uh, oh, there it is. It's right there. Four right. minutes to touch Straight down. Above. with wings level approaching the heading alignment cylinder. Again, it'll perform a 204 degree right turn to align with uh, the runway. That's an imaginary cylinder created by the microwave scan beam landing system. This now, a view, a view through the heads up display on board Discovery. This uh, point of view of the pilot of Discovery uh, from a uh, heads up display in front of pilot Pam Melroy. now beginning its uh, right to turn, a 204 degree turn to align with runway 22. Altitude 32,000 feet. Discovery speed 500 miles per hour. miles to touchdown. Discovery on at the 180. That call that Discovery's right on target with 180 degrees to go in this turn to align with the runway. Wings angled about 50 degrees from horizontal. It continues a uh, right bank. Altitude 23,000 feet. Speed 500 miles per hour. Discovery on at the 90. Roger on. That call that Discovery remains on target, 90 degrees left to go to align with runway 22. One minute, 45 seconds to touchdown. Runway in sight, Houston. Copy, runway in sight. leveling, altitude 10,000 feet, Altitude 5,000 feet. Come on, baby. on board. Main gear touchdown. Nose gear touchdown. Discovery home after completing one of the most complex missions to date and setting the stage for the first permanent occupation of the International Space Station beginning next week. Discovery 
rolling out on runway 22 at Edwards Air Force Base. Twelve days, twenty-one hours, forty-three minutes in orbit. Wheel stop, Houston. Copy wheel stop, Brian. Your great landing today made everybody happy at Edwards Air Force Base. Welcome back to Earth after a super successful mission. Great to be back, bro. You can follow. Congratulations once again. We'd like to take Fess Tri Alpha to off, Brian.